this is Galaxy Z Flip 3 and with the workaround that I'll show you guys in this video you can actually make calls reply to a text message on the go and open up pretty much any app from the cover screen like YouTube to watch videos WhatsApp to make audio or a video call and even reply to a WhatsApp message reply view and send files via a text message play music straight from the cover screen even from various third-party apps and finally play pretty much any games right from the cover screen guys you're watching with Steven if it's your first time here thank you so much for clicking here's your review smart smartwatches smartphones headphones etc surf into all that kind of stuff you must consider subscribing everything is time coded along the video timeline for ease of you now let me start by showing you how to get started with this workaround. Now I'm not the developer of this workaround cover screen widget and you should try it at your own discretion. This magic is done by a widget called Samsung Launcher, formerly known as Z Flip Launcher. The three major caveat of using this widget is number one, you have to uninstall the Samsung Health app. This is very important as if you install this widget without uninstalling Samsung Health app, it will just not work. Now a caution here is to make sure you have the backup of your data before uninstalling the Samsung Health app or else you will lose the data. Now number two, you have to go in the settings, lock screen and disable the screen lock by selecting none. Doing this will erase your biometric data like fingerprints. Now don't ask me why but you have to disable the security screen lock in order for this to work and I assume because this widget pretty much opens the app on the main display which by the way is closed shut and projects its content to the cover display and to do so it has to bypass the lock screen. Now number three you have to delete a widget from the cover display to make room for the Samsung launcher. Now once you have followed these three steps, you can go ahead in the video description and download the Samsung APK from the link that I have provided. From the link you won't see a direct download button but just click on the assets to reveal the downloadable files. Just go ahead and download the Samsung signed.apk file. Now you will have to allow installation from unknown sources in order to install this APK which I have already done. So once it's installed, you're all set to go. You will see the Samsung launcher icon in the menu. Once you open it, you can select which apps you want to be displayed on the cover screen. To make the widget screen tidy, I have only selected few apps that I really want. Now you can select either list style view or grid view widget style. I personally prefer the grid style view uh, as it looks dope. Let me know which one would you prefer. Now on the cover screen you can touch and hold to access the widgets. At the very end you'll find an option to add a widget. Go ahead and select Samsung launcher and you can rearrange the launcher to whatever position you want. I prefer it to be right after the clock. And that is it you are now all set. This widget is a proof that there are chances that Samsung could do something like this in future with an update. Also with my personal testing, I have seen better battery performance with the Galaxy Z Flip 3 as now I don't have to unflip the phone every time as I can do most of the basic task right from the cover display which will consume less power. Now let me show you some live demo of all its use case scenario that have solved a lot of issues that I had with the Galaxy Z Flip 3. Comment down below what will you guys use this widget for and guys also hit that like button and consider subscribing for more tech related videos. Come on guys just do it, likes and subscribe is free. Now the major problem that I had with the Galaxy Z Flip 3 is to make a call I had to flip it open. Now. I'm someone who doesn't mind using the speakerphone to talk or I have my earbuds connected to the phone all the time. So from the widget, you can select the call app and you can access the keypad to dial a call or you can make a call from the recent call history or even access contacts. Pretty cool. So finally, you can call straight from the cover display. Now you can also do that for pretty much any third-party calling app. Let me show you this with the WhatsApp. 
By the way, to exit any app, you have to press the home key or the button and then slide to the widget again to select another app. Let's go ahead and open up WhatsApp. From here, you can access the chat and even call from the calls you can make an audio or a video call. Unfortunately, if you were to make a video call, your video will be paused unless you flip the Z Flip 3 open. But hey, isn't it great that you finally can do this? Not just that, you can even go under chat and send a message with a GIF animation. You can attach files. You can even take a photo but I personally use the voice memo option to send a quick audio message like I'm on the way or something. You can do this for pretty much any messaging app. Let's see what options do we get with the default messaging app. You can again send emojis, attach files, pictures, and I use the voice memo feature again to send a quick reply. This is amazing and it works great. Now you can reply a message on the go straight from the cover screen. I really wish we had a keyboard or at least a voice assistant to dictate a reply. Now you can pretty much open any app that you can see on the widget. And from my testing, all the apps work great. I am curious to know which app you will be using on a regular basis from this cover display. Comment down below. Let's open Instagram. Now Instagram will by default open vertically. And to be honest, that's how it will look better as with the other way around, the pictures will cut off due to less screen real estate. But for me, the Instagram browsing experience is great. By the way, you can follow me on Instagram and the link for all my social media is linked in the video description. I can also access useful apps on the go like calculator app to do a quick calculation straight from the cover display. I can also access gallery to view images and videos from the album stored on the smartphone. That's pretty cool. The most app that I use is the points card app. As prior to this widget, I had to flip the phone open to access this app to scan the barcode but now I can access and get the point card scan straight from the cover display. This is really helpful. Now on top of all this, I can also watch videos from the cover display, which is not that great of an experience for watching movies from Amazon Prime or Netflix. But I would say it certainly is enough to watch a quick tips or tutorial video from the YouTube app. I have over 400 videos combined on both my channels, which I suggest you should check it out as you will find something interesting like this video. Finally, let me wrap this video with playing a game. I have tried a lot of games and you can most certainly play any titles like Assassin's Creed, Gangster Vegas, GTA Liberty City, San Andreas, Mario Kart, Need for Speed, but let me play some cool retro games on an emulator. This is Mario, which is my favorite game. If you're someone who grew up playing these retro games, comment down below your favorite retro game. I would love to hear that. Another retro game that I want to show you is the Tomb Raider Lara Croft. Honestly, I wouldn't play long games like GTA or Assassin's Creed, but I can certainly see myself playing this NES retro games while I'm waiting for something as it's better to play it on this cover display rather than on a smartwatch. So I really hope you found this video helpful. I replied to 95% of the comments made on this channel and I would love to see your comment. Also guys, please hit that like button as it really helps out my channel and please consider subscribing for such awesome videos. That is it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, check these videos out as you may find them enticing.